Madam President, we now know how Menendez pulled it off. It's now clear that Menendez intended to be captured and brought to the Obama in order to execute his attack. It was all a part of his Trojan plan. Force. Odysseus. He used a Solarium device to infect our internal servers with a virus, compromising our entire military and satellite infrastructure. The bad news is, the drones are still his. He's piggybacking on communication satellites all over the world. Oh, shit. What are our options? Well, there is some good news. We've traced the source of the signals. Haiti! JSOC's in the sky right now. In T minus 10 minutes, we'll be boots on the ground. How long before the drones get to the other cities? At the current rate and trajectory, approximately T minus 10. Oh my god, what about China? We are launching a coordinated, simultaneous attack on Haiti. We can trust Premier Chen now. He will not let us down. So. Is this it? Hold on. <laughs> Is this the end? Madam President. That's a lot of fucking drones, dude. God help us. But something I noticed is that with 619, the fact they had attacked LA too is just hella convenient because what's LA's zip code? Time on target, 60 seconds. Okay, you're set! Judgment days, here we go. Ladies and gents. Confirmed. My god. Listen up, we have our objectives. Shut down the transmission controlling the drones. Execute kill capture order on target Raul Menendez. Once and for all, this is the mission finale, so we need to go in guns blazing. Let's go! Get out, get out. Holy shit! Well, no choice anymore. Let's do it! Control your descent! Oh my god. I thought it was kill capture order. Make up your mind, David. Yeah, 
there. That'll stop if you're good. know if we're gonna get an orbital strike we're gonna use it right it's only fair kinetic strike weapon is online be advised i'm calling down the thunder hell yeah okay now let's actually uh be able to use it though What? Oh my god, the Chinese freaking dropped there just now, did they? Motherfucker. Alright, fine, then I'm just not gonna use it up there. You happy? Unbelievable. There. You guys can drop there now. Throw another. Let's fix that. Do it. Yeah. Everyone on me. Push into the building. No more claws. Continuing to help us, man. Oh my god. What the hell? This way, downstairs. Seriously? They used in the last game. Oh, oh sorry. Shut down the broadcast signals. That sounds very familiar. <laughs> oh my God! They just killed each other off. God, I can't escape the RPG assholes. Alright, are we good now? I think so. Alright, let's do it. Yeah! Oh my god, why are there so many? Fix that. 
Fix that problem. Oh my god. There! That was worth it. Keep moving! Broadcast room's just ahead! Stay there for the located broadcast source. SC1, say status. One of the series building perimeter established. SC1, switch profile to checkpoint responsibilities. Avoid this place locked down. Roger that. Enemy quads incoming! Ah! Move! Get back, get back! Oh, that hurt. Oh, so much for our drone. Oh my god, dude! Upstairs. Shit. Uh, my console crashed. What do you guys? Can you get in? Ron Menendez is transmitting a live webcast. He's on right now. Oh, there he is. Out. Can you hack into the system? They thought I wanted to kill the president. We're fucked. Doña Presidente, I could have buried you a million times over. No. I wanted you to see it. To feel what it's like. The drones are being controlled from Haiti. What? Sir, there's nothing more we can do. Oh. Today, we cannot regain access to the drones. Two billion people exist. In abject misery. Nice He's ready to strike New York. You gotta stop it. How? Oh, wait a minute. Doña Presidente. What the fuck? Your war machine tunnel. He self destructed the drones. Your military. Why? He's crippled. You cannot stop us now. Oh, Menendez. What is the Menendez does right. know how to make a theatrical entrance, Let's doesn't move he? Out. Section, we got a body, one of ours. He's been stripped of his uniform and kit. Wait, don't move him! Oh, shit. Alright, excuse me, bro. Section, this is SE2. We're monitoring multiple explosions across the facility. It's Menendez. He's trying to cover his escape. All stations, this net. All checkpoints contain anyone attempting to leave AO, even those in uniform. Oh, no. All right, Menendez. Where the fuck are you? Checkpoint 4's location of my HUD. We're Americans. Take it easy. Orders are no one passes. Stop where you are. Relax. We're on the same team. Checkpoint 4 is down. We need to move. I haven't used the AM94 a lot, so I'm not against the uh, using it right now. The hell? Oh, shit. Hey, no attention to him earlier. Damn. Oh my god, am I really out of those grenades? Son of a bitch. Okay, 
that works for me. We gotta go! Nope! I found it! Had it with these damn grenades! Now slide! Oh shit. Oh god, that sounded brutal. Hey, asshole. Alright. Make it happen! End the story! Now it's your turn, you old fuck! This time you're getting captured for good. Get your ass moving! Go! You've had it your way for way too long. He's just a sad old man talking to himself. Let him talk. <laughs> that one, that one pitched the nerve. <laughs> it's like a motherfucker. Let me have my monologues. Not anymore. Oh my god. Okay. Well, I pretty much did my part for the rest of this. Good grief. The best possible ending that we could get out of the game. Do not enter. I swear to God, I will shove this wheelchair right up your ass. Mason! Hey, Woods. You look like hammered shit. You stay right there. <laughs> These real woods. Mason. They shot you. Turns out you're a lousy shot. My ass. Where the fuck have you been for 30 years? Colonel Kurtz. Solarium worm attacking the electrical grid. Power stations. Water distribution. It's every state. Can't escape it, man. Oh wait, it's all over the world. Give me the president. Chill out, jerk off. I got it. It's all right. Well, leave it to karma to fix our problems. David Mason for Sergeant Woods. Another Mason. Oh boy. Oh, fuck. Secure the building. <laughs> he doesn't know. Hey, kid. Jeez, Come on. Break. Introduce you to somebody. Hey, this is Dave. Dave. How you doing? <laughs> this is your dad. <laughs> what? <laughs> like so, <laughs> so casual. Like, what the fuck? Dad. Dad. 
Yeah, you even see him moving his face around a bit during that scene, too. What the fuck? I, yeah. fucking boy. <laughs> I agree. Get shit on your own. There's some smokes. There's bat shit. Where's my smokes? What? Please. Still got that score. You made me proud that day. I fell. Yeah. But you got back up. Damn right you did. Oh, man. As much as I want to watch the next scene, if you know, you know. So I guess you're famous now for saving the world. That is just so random, Jimmy Kimmel just being in this for no reason. <laughs> Salty much? Yeah, he ain't happy. <laughs> well, that has pretty much been it for the Black Ops 2 campaign, dude. Like, it is definitely also one of my favorite in the series. BO1 and BO2 has just been up there for me. So much character, and you definitely felt that the story got a little darker during this one in general too just because of the whole um story around revolving around like Woods, Menendez, Mason and David as well and even Hudson too he was kind of just left behind once he got halfway done through the story but yeah man like I I definitely appreciated what they did with it and yeah, it, it is kind of funny that David was pretty much given plot armor throughout the entire story because there isn't a scenario where he would die and everyone else on the other hand is fair game but we got the best ending that we could with Menendez getting captured with Karma being able to uh, you know slowly but surely reverse the uh, Solarium worm and then just blah 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 and of course, Alex surviving, and David getting that reunion with them. Although we never, to my knowledge, I don't think we ever got, like, the true canonical ending to this game. But considering where Black Ops 3 goes from here, it doesn't really matter that much. But anyways, that's gonna do it for the Black Ops 2 campaign, guys. As per usual, I had a blast going through this, and hopefully you guys did as well. But tune in next week where we actually dive into probably the dark horse of the series in terms of the, the Black Ops game, which is BO3. So that's going to be a very interesting one to go back into. But until then, thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Fight on, everyone.